Good morning. So we're on our way to the airport. It's 7 a.m. We did want to leave the house by 6.30, but it's fine because Mitch included like 30 minutes of <laughs> exactly for this reason. So we're actually right on time. Okay, we just got through security. I feel like everything this morning has been chaotic. I feel like whenever I vlog, the only thing I ever say is chaotic, but traffic was insane. We bored in probably 20 minutes. Can I have a bite of that? What flavor is this? Strawberry apple. Why does everything have apple? I don't I don't know. It's kind of like their base. Ooh, ooh. Uh, that was not a good one. I don't like dried fruit, and that's literally like two ingredients of fruit, dried fruit only. Anyways, now me just chit-chatting about nothing. Mitch and I decided to come visit Grandpa. As always, there's Mitch. Say hi. Hi. He's shy, but yeah. Grandpa. Alright, ready? Why don't you talk? <laughs> me and so Mitch randomly goes to me and looks over he goes, so I have something to tell you. So I found this out after we booked the trip. Come I was like, fun. I was looking at like reviews and like how things are at this place and some of the reviews were like, like there's poop on the beach. What type of poop? <laughs> and, and I was like, oh shoot. And so I started like researching a little bit and human <laughs> because there's this island that they just dump all their sewage in the ocean and then it like floats up on shore and it's like in the water. So like we may not be swimming in the water there, but... What the hell? But they have really nice pools. They do have like a lazy river. <laughs> because we were really hungry. <laughs> it's really pretty here. Okay, we completely forgot to give you a little tour of our hotel room. Um, we, I already took a nap, so ignore that. But here is the bathroom. She's cute. Huge tub that actually like, you can open a window and go out there. And then, we already ate all the snacks. We had the Pringles and the- And all the beer. <laughs> and all, look how cute these are. Look at, they're baby mini ones. So we may or may not be moving rooms, but when we upgraded, they only had two double beds and not a king bed. But I honestly don't mind sharing a small bed. I like cuddling. And then the room service just dropped this off for us. Champagne with some saran wrapped apples. <laughs> And then outside we have this cute little swim up. 
Oh, it's, is it foggy out here? Oh, <gasps> my camera's like not adjusting. Oops, sorry guys, hold on. Okay, it's super foggy right now, so I'm just gonna let my camera get acclimated and then I'll, I'll show you the rest and then I'll show you when we go to dinner. Okay, we're a little bit better acclimated. I feel like it's still foggy. Oh my god. Okay, never mind. So Mitch is gonna pop the champagne because he said that he can't iron over there unless he's drinking a bottle of champagne. So Okay. I'm not gonna bring you guys to dinner because we're just we're just gonna go enjoy dinner. We're going to the Italian restaurant. Portofino. Portofino. They have what dish I want? Parm chicken parm. Chicken parm. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had that since I've been a non-vegetarian, so I'm excited to get that. But we'll fit check. Okay, she's a little short. Um, dresses from Zara. Shoes are probably from Amazon or Princess Polly, something. That's it. And then Mitch, H&M. H&M. I think the pants Zara. are either H or M or Zara. Shoes are... DSW. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we're not going to bring you to dinner, but I'll insert some pics of dinner and stuff. Okay. Bye, you guys. Good morning. I didn't even say goodnight last night. We went and got Italian food. It was so good. Like, I had chicken parm for the first time in a long time, and it was just, like, amazing. Um, but as you can see, I'm dressed for the gym, um, and so is Mitch, I think. Oh yeah, he's changing right now, but um, the view right now, hold on. I'm not gonna take you outside because you know what happened last time. The condensation just went wild. Hold on. Anyways, we're about to go work out, and then we're gonna go to get breakfast, and then today's plan, in my opinion, is just to sit and do nothing all day on the beach. And then I think at noon we have to call to make reservations at Oceana, which is the one restaurant we really, really want to go to, and I have this really pretty little orange dress I'm gonna wear. So, I'm excited. Okay, typically I never like work out on vacation, but like I do work out on vacation, but I don't like make it a point to work out every single day, if that makes sense. So, if you see me working out, I don't want you to feel like you have to work out on vacation. I just like to get a little movement. We're probably gonna be for maybe 30 minutes. I just walked for 10 minutes. I was gonna walk outside, but it's 90 something degrees and so, so humid. I think I would've died. But I'm gonna go, they have a Smith machine here. So I think I'm gonna do like a couple exercises, maybe one or two exercise, uh, exercises. Maybe like RDLs and I don't know what else. And then there's a basketball hoop outside. So I think we're gonna go shoot hoops for like a couple minutes and then go have breakfast. and I just shot that ball and it felt so unnatural. <laughs> Just naming off. <gasps> Look at these baby donuts! <laughs> okay, we just got back from the pool, or we were in these like little cabana things for preferred members. It was like down by the beach. It was so relaxing. It's what time is it? Four? It's 3:45. I think Mitch and I are going to take a little dip on our pool out here. I might bring you with me if the stupid camera can adjust. And then we're gonna go into the, like the pool pool and like go to the swamp bar and play around. But it's kind of hard to vlog here because like we're literally just relaxing, doing nothing. So yeah. Oh, let me show you. Let me show you my swimsuit. It's super cute. It's from Monday Swim. But this is her. <laughs> she was really expensive for no reason. I don't know why I spent my money on this. I have a skim suit that I love just as much and yeah but she's cute okay we're gonna go take a dip and hopefully my stupid camera doesn't get all fogged up when i take you out there <laughs> let's be honest is the whole vlog gonna be literally right here in my bedroom probably i just 
I don't think I'm gonna bring you to dinner because we're just gonna be eating. Like, you guys don't care. But I'll show you my fit. Okay, can you see me? Oh, okay. Cute, cute. Not me surprising myself when I literally got dressed myself. Um, dresses from Aritzia. Shoes are from probably Princess Polly or Amazon. Bag is from Amazon. I'm wearing an extra small on the dress. This is my favorite dress in the entire world. I need to go back and get it in like 10 more colors. My poor baby can't decide what to wear. So he's been, he irons the outfit entirely, puts it on and is like, no, I'm not gonna wear this. I'm like, please sir, he's like the king of ironing. We'll get changed, get dinner, and I'll I'll post, I'll like put little pics, show you what we had. I'm probably gonna get steak again. I'm kinda <laughs> sad I couldn't iron your dress. Like I wanted to iron your outfit. This man is you. obsessed with ironing. Goodbye. So I don't know if you guys can see, look how pretty this little path is. We are staying like over there and then we just had to walk over here to Oceana, there she is. Mitch is so funny. What? Not me smiling for the picture with my vlog camera. I'm just doing this because he's taking photos. Anyways, we're gonna go to the restaurant and dumb. Mitch is funny. That's a dumb photo. That is so funny, Mitch. Okay, one thing that Mitch and I have kind of come to the conclusion of at all-inclusive restaurants is that they give you portion sizes like this big so instead of ordering like one app and one entree we literally order three apps each had an entree and we still might be hungry afterward to be determined but last night Mitch was still hungry so that's just one thing we've kind of noticed with these all-inclusive okay you guys I got a crab waffle. I don't know what I thought that was gonna look like, but it literally, they put it in a waffle maker. Look how cute that is. I'm so excited. And then we also got quinoa salad and... Shrimp remoulade? Shrimp, shrimp something other. It's basically a bed of lettuce with three shrimp on top. Three shrimp. See what I'm saying? Like the portion sizes here are itty bitty, but it'll be okay. Anyways. Okay, one thing that Mitch and I always do when we eat out is that we make sure we get two entrees that we both really want. So halfway through the meal we can switch. You should start doing this with your when you go on date night because you get a little bit of everything. Shoot, we didn't show you anything before we started digging in. Okay, well anyways, um I got a flank steak. Well, Mitch got a flank steak, we just traded. And then the other dish was a shrimp. It was basically a ton of vegetables and a sauce with a bunch of shrimp on it. Wow. So, it was really good. Okay, also, one thing about us is that we always get dessert. And look how small these portions are. But we got chocolate cake with mint ice cream and then a red wine, fruit, something or other. Yes, my favorite ice cream in the world is mint chocolate chip, so this is kind of the best of both worlds. And then that weird fruit thing that Mitch wanted so badly. You guys know how I told you the serving sizes here at this all-inclusive are this big. Like, I swear everything is a kid's meal. So we just literally had a room service bring us a cheeseburger, a Philly cheese steak, and a margarita pizza. Okay, so we also didn't bring a lot of, like, we both forgot our pajamas. We so. brought swimsuits and fancy clothes. So Mitch is wearing the robe and I'm wearing like my outfit I wore on the plane. But anyways, look at the food. Okay, like, yes. A bunch of Diet Cokes. Yes. Good morning. We were supposed to be at early birds this morning. Didn't happen. The fire alarm went off at like 6 a.m. Tell me why as the fire alarm went off, me and Mitch are just like, Imagine if it was a real fire. We were just so tired. We're like, no, this can't be real. We're just gonna sleep until it turns off. After like five minutes, it finally turned off. We're going to the gym. I don't know what I'm doing. Probably gonna play basketball again, but creatine. I've been, I've been so good about my creatine. Like, get on your creatine, y'all. I'm not even kidding. This is my favorite supplement in the entire world. I feel like it's the main reason I make gains. Fit is Gymshark. Wearing a size small, minimal bra, size small. Contour seamless? I think that's what this is. Okay, we're gonna go to the gym. We got home from the gym, rushed to our little cabanas down at the beach. Forgot to update you guys. Literally did nothing but sleep and lay. But bathing suit, 
She's from Skims. You guys don't sleep on Skims bathing suits. This top was $36. Bottoms were like $28 or $36, but um, I know you guys know how freaking expensive bathing suits are, and I feel like I can never find any that are like under $100. Like usually for a top, it's like $75 plus. It's sickening, especially for like such little material, but we're just taking a little break. We're gonna go back to the pool. And yeah, I think we're gonna play cards. Where are our cards? We spent oh like $23 on cards last night at the gift shop because we forgot to bring some, but it'll be fine. Mems. This is absolutely hilarious to me because, okay, long story short, we checked into our hotel or into this in all-inclusive and we decided we wanted an upgrade. So that means we wanted like a little swim out pool, like attached to our room, a private pool. But the only downside was, was because we booked like so last second for that upgrade, they didn't have any king beds available. So they said after one night, we would be able to switch rooms to a king room and we were just like, we don't really want to move all our stuff. Like that's just a lot. And so we had two queen beds, I believe. This is so funny to me. They literally took our two queen beds, pushed them together. Oh, there's like a mattress. Wait, they like, I guess they put like a, a mattress or something down so no one's gonna fall in the crack. But do you see how massive this bed is? That is so funny to me. All right, you guys, not me popping in and out like I do, but just wanted to show you my dinner fit. Let's go to the mirror. She's cute. She's this little crochet dress. Crochet, crochet dress. I'm wearing like little nippy pads just to cover because it is like there are little holes. But yeah, she's really cute. She's from Maritzia. My hair is straight. I blue dry it straight. With this humidity, I know for a fact it will not be the straight when I get home tonight, but we are going to Hibachi and apparently there are only 50 reservations available So we had to like book at noon today and we got a spot for 8 p.m I don't know why it's so difficult to get into because it didn't really seem that difficult But we're going to Hibachi and we're gonna bring you with us Hopefully I can film without being like obnoxious, but if you've never been to Hibachi like Mitch has never been So I really want to get his reaction and just like, you know, how he how he likes it. Come over here <laughs> Show me the fit bay Yes. Is um Zara? Zara. Not sure. DSW. Um, DSW. You're cute. Okay, let's go take pics and then go to dinner. Alright. Okay, we are the first ones here for our reservation. <laughs> Look how cute and pretty the wall the wall is with all the fish. Okay, amigos. Tonight we have a one special celebration. So we stopped at the cafe <laughs> to finish the night off with espresso shots. But wait, double devil's chocolate cake. Mm. Oh. There's no double, it's just one chocolate. Mm. I've been eyeing this. It's a blackberry cheesecake croissant. Like, have you ever seen a red croissant? Why are you buying the side of everything? That's where all the goods are. Seven dollars, eight dollars. Would I like this? 
this devil's chocolate cake. Mm-hmm. Shot. Shooter's gonna shoot. Oh. It's hot. This would be a little bit better if it was just a little less dry. She's just been sitting in the cabinet a little too long. Okay, I'm gonna go. Love you guys. We're probably just gonna go to bed. Me too. Not us going MIA yesterday. So what happened was we ended up just laying out all day. Went swimming actually last night. It's so windy. It's like 20 mile an hour winds here. Like actually insane. We went swimming. We were just tired and wet and ended up just coming home and staying in the rest of the night. We didn't even go get dinner because we did eat at like five o'clock, like at the pool bar. So it wasn't like we weren't really hungry but we stayed in, watched like stand up <laughs> all night. The water out there is so pretty, look, so pretty. Anyways, we're about to go to Dreams, which is next door and go in the lazy river and just do nothing all day. Today's our last day. And then we have our little romantic dinner tonight, which I'm hoping, technically it's supposed to be on the beach. And with these 20 mile per hour winds, I don't know if I want to be on the beach. So I'll keep you posted if we end up going to the beach or if they like reschedule it somewhere and we end up doing it inside at like a restaurant. My camera's on six percent so I'm really thinking it but they can be gonna show you what we got okay. Okay. okay we are late for dinner but here I am vlogging because I have to show you the fit. This is the dress okay dealt um we're going to like our cute little like special dinner that we're kind of doing. I don't know. I don't know. We got bamboozled into doing this, so we're going to our cute little dinner. Dress is from Zara. Mitch's whole outfit is from Zara, and we're gonna bring you guys with us. Okay, so we decided to move our like beach romantic dinner inside because of the wind. There's like 20 mile per hour winds. So we're actually like eating in a wine cellar. So cute in private, like literally the wine, Mitch. Look at the cute little swans. So basically we had a food menu that we like chose all our options for and I think they're just gonna start dropping them off. So that'll be fun. So one thing about me is I hate wine. Not me sipping this and taste testing it and acting like, mmm, that's good, pour me more. Mitch. You're, I expect you to drink that. I feel like yeah. I big this class is. Nice tonight. Do you see how big this is? Or is that, am I just a newbie? It's massive. Nice tonight, you like mine. I know, he, <laughs> he just brought bread by and he gave us three options, so we chose two, but I'm like, I want the third option. So we got croissants with cheese inside, an onion roll, and then the last one was a white bread roll. I wanted that. But look at this baby empanada. Okay, cute. Look at my extra cheese. Mm. I'm lemon and clay too. Okay, so we have a problem. I want a Diet Coke, not a glass of wine. <laughs> okay, so this is here. I have a cheap salad, but I'm trying to be healthy. Mitch got scallops. I can't tell you what this is, but we're on our third part. This is soup, and then he got lobster bisque, which it's a win every time. And your, yours isn't just soup, it's it? cream chowder. Um, or something chowder. I'm gonna be honest, I couldn't tell you what, what flavor. I'm just wondering what flavor this is once you've taken it by yours. It's creamy. My hair just had to go up. Okay, our main course just arrived. I got steak, shrimp, mashed potatoes, and a red stick. And then Mitch got sea bass with asparagus. <laughs> He's like a skinny legend or something because I don't know why his portion size is the size of my See, and I'm fighting the urge every single time I have a steak to not ask for ketchup.
I think we're just gonna go back to the room, maybe go for a mini mini walk. And sleep. Um, and then go to sleep because we have to have our bags out of our room by 9 a.m. because our car, our bus, leaves at 9.30 a.m. for the airport. Good night. We will see you guys in the <laughs> Okay Mitch, do your clothes out. Wait, no, say your thing. Okay, good night you guys. We'll see you in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. We are leaving today. Very sad. <laughs> um, our gigantic bed. That will never not be funny to me. We're about to go get some food and then leave. Our our okay, our flight is at 2 p.m. Tell me why we're leaving. Our car takes us to the airport at 9:30. It's a 30-minute bus ride. So we're gonna be at the airport for four hours. That's crazy to me, but Hopefully the airport has air conditioning because I feel like here didn't really have air conditioning like it does, but the coolest it gets is 71. Me, I run hot. I need the room to be at like 68, 69. Maybe I'm just spoiled, but anyways, we're gonna get food. Do you have anything to say, babe? I'm sad, I don't wanna go home. <laughs> <laughs> we just got to the airport. I also, I hope you can hear me, I'm using my little shotgun mic. I probably should have been using it this entire trip, but it makes my setup so large that I get really shy, like carrying around my big tripod and camera and then having my mic with the little fluffy thing set on top. But um, we just got to the airport, we're four hours early. I'm not okay. We just got to the airport, we don't know what to do for the next four hours. So I think we're gonna sit here and play cards we're both feeling like a little icky from all the food. Not all the food, but I want to say the types of foods that we've been eating the past few days. So we're like, we're trying to see what restaurants, like right now there's a sushi tequila and a margaritaville option. Both those options just don't seem great in terms of like not feeling sick afterwards. So I think we're just gonna play cards here at this table and then maybe find like a little grab and go and grab some more snacks. But we're literally so early to our flight that the flight before us is boarding now. Like we can't even, there's not space to sit at our gate, you know? Oh, but what we do have, cacolates. Cacolates. Oh. peanut M&Ms. We've been having these like every single day because they put them in our room. And the last night they gave us four of them because we told them how much we love them. But that's it from us. Okay. I think we're gonna play cards. We're either gonna play gin or we're gonna play war. Because of the only two people card games we know how to play. Also, I am hopping on the Touchland hand sanitizer. I didn't buy this myself. I would never spend, I, these are kind of expensive. I wanna say these are like 10 freaking dollars. I would never buy it myself, but I won't lie. Like how cute is that? Both, I have two of them. Both of them were sent to me like in PR packages and stuff. So that's the only reason why I have them. But I won't lie, I do love them. You guys, not me doing that thing where I'm vlogging and then I disappear and then all of a sudden it's been a week since my vlog or like my trip ended and I'm closing out my vlog. I'm so bad about that. So basically what happened was like we just, me and Mitch had the most chill, relaxing last day in, where were we even? Cancun. Then we traveled home. We were so tired that like, I didn't even think to like pull out my camera at all. Yeah, we got home and then I just never closed out the vlog. So here we are. Um, I was getting so many questions about like my outfits and my swimsuits and all of that. So I'll link that below for you guys because I cannot reply to all the DMs. I'm trying so hard to keep up, but I hope you guys enjoyed. I am gonna try and be better about vlogging and just like being more consistent, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I will talk to you next time. <laughs>